Australians are, seem like they're relatively even keeled and consultants are relatively even keeled. So you seem to be, from my knowledge of you, a relatively even keeled guy. But Wall Street CEOs are thought to be people who throw things at the walls and scream and yell and slam foams down. So is that image wrong or you just have succeeded even though you're relatively low key or do you actually throw things as well? I mean, you seem very really modest and uh, controlled in your personality. Aren't you used to CEOs that are throwing things? Well, I think if you're the seventh of 12 children, you don't want to be the thrower. Okay. You know, that's not going to end so well. Um, no, I think part of it is honestly just personality, and that, pr that probably helps shape you. Your personal family obviously does. But I think these businesses have been on a 30-year uh, transition from very tightly held private partnerships, where frankly, you know, more extreme be personal behavior, taking more risk because it's your own money, et cetera, et cetera, was par for the course. Versus now, these are big global corporations. You know, we we're relatively small among the big banks here, and we we're, we've got a $2 trillion of clients' assets. We have a trillion dollar balance sheet. We have 55,000 employees. We're all over the world. These are major global corporations. They've got to behave and act like major global corporations. I don't see a Jeff Immelt okay. or a Ginny Romney or any of those executives behaving the way, you know, maybe the historical caricature of a Wall Street would have.